on today guys and my camera is fucking up I see what YouTube talking about they've been having these problems but so it's a morning time it's a new day I really wish my camera could stop fogging up but we're gonna go ahead and do this but yes guys it's early in the morning really early in the morning it seemed like the only time I can actually do my videos 7:25 a.m. but yeah See, early in the morning, 7.25. But, hold on, I really got to do something about this camera. Alright guys, much better. I guess it's too early for the cameras too. But, yes, I have a lot of explaining to do. Huh, where have I been? Or more importantly, where is my car? as you see my car ain't there anymore right now my mom is just parked there my brother's just parked there well y'all gonna be very surprised with me but it's back in the garage right beside the Mach 1 so yes I did clean up this side of the garage you're welcome mom <laughs> but yeah everything is just kind of pushed around and moved over there's the engine to the v6 yeah but yeah anyways <clears throat> the reason why I'm making this video all right guys uh, if my phone if uh, the camera vibrates or move around or shake or anything like that it's because I'm using my phone as a prop for my camera so if you hear like a noise or something like that like, yeah it's my phone anyways I got a lot of explaining to do. With my car, I have so many people telling me, oh, it can't be your engine, it can't be your pistons messed up or anything like that. If it is, you need to try this. If it is, you need to try that. So I was doing all of these, like, last chances for the motor and whatnot. And... Yeah, none of them work, unfortunately. See, that's what I'm talking about. I had someone look at my heads and whatnot to make sure that, uh, to make sure that it was still good or whatever, and make sure that there was nothing going on with it. I took the whole car. Yes, I basically towed the car with my mom's car. See right here. This has been a long night. What time is it? It's like 10 o'clock, right? 10 10. I'm still going at it. <laughs> <laughs> Many hours later. I'm sorry, I had to put you through this. But we finally got it here at the shop now. Yeah. It's about one o'clock now. We left the house at like 10. So yeah, you can imagine all the BS we went through. But yeah, we about to take this dolly back and then we're gonna go home and go to sleep. They take a look at it and they basically laughed when I came in the next day. They told me to sit down and whatnot and all that good stuff and they was like, huh, uh, you probably melt a piston. What? I believe I melt a piston. I'm, I'm not sure how. I, I don't know. They said they looked at it. The air seeping out the crankcase. The top of the piston is like extremely black. So, this is a piston right here. This is the top of the piston where the spark plugs is at. You know, you add your air, your uh, your gas and your spark and whatnot that forces it down, so it keeps the engine moving. Basically, it's your piston rings. This is what I thought that was messed up on my car. Yeah, because oil was coming out from through here to here. Well. 
to where it, to what they made it sound like was it's probably either melt a hole through here through the back of it so the oil is just going straight out through the top or it probably warped it a certain way and it's coming out through the sides I'm not sure I'm not that mechanically inclined to uh, pull apart a motor so I made a decision the decision I made is the reason why this car is back in the garage and I got everything cleaned out uh, probably in a couple of weeks I'm gonna get rid of the Mach 1 I'm probably gonna end up getting rid of the Mach 1 I already took the door off and all that I'm finna part it out and whatnot reason being is because I'm gonna need this space to, to, to put a new motor in my car yeah I gotta redo what I did before it sucks but I mean I gotta do what I gotta do right so yeah I made my decision with this motor it's it's going bye bye you may ask there is it shouldn't take you that long to figure out what was going on with your motor right well it didn't and here's why I took so long to make this video first of all I just got out of a cold so I'm still kind of feeling a little stuffy or whatever so I'm good second I lost a lot of money because I was trying to do something with the car and it didn't even turn out it didn't turn out the way I wanted so I had to get the money back which took shoot a couple months for it to get back so yeah that was also on hold you know can't, can't get a motor when you don't have the money to you know what I mean third <clears throat> I, I just really been so busy honestly guys like this is the reason why I be making my videos in the morning time before I have to go to work because I'm just so busy I'm always busy so I want to apologize to you guys I want to apologize to my family my friends because like I'm literally just always working but don't take it personally the only reason why I'm working so much so much is to make content for you guys I would much rather be here doing this every single day than to be at work you know I'd rather be hanging out with my family than to be at work you know stuff happens life happens I'm also in another process of I'm probably gonna end up getting another car to be honest with you because I keep driving my brother's car my mom's car the moped yes I said it, the moped yes I've been getting around on it sometimes that's like the last result and most of the time my girlfriend be taking me to work so I'm blessed to have all these rides and have two cars that don't work basically but anyways just kind of getting you up to date or up to speed don't copyright me for that if y'all watch donut media don't copyright me <laughs> here's everything you need to know to get up to speed on the Ford Mustang. But anyway, what else been happening? I made a lot of videos that I was gonna post out there, but it's just literally like, it just looked like the whole towing video night. That, that was just, mm. we was all stressed that night. My car almost got messed up on the tow dolly. Almost messed up a fender or side skirt on there. Man, almost messed up my mom's truck. Just a whole bunch of. They was out there in the middle of the night. We didn't. We stayed out there until like one o'clock, I think. It's either twelve or one. I don't know. It was still late because we both had school and work in the morning, and all of us did. So everybody was kind of mad and whatnot. But uh, we did what we had to do. Oh, 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 I don't, I don't know how I've been forgetting about this. I've been working on a couple videos for my friends, too. I got one car review coming up. I also got... Hang on. Man. Excuse me. See, that's what I was talking about, getting over a cold. 
I'm working on a couple of my friends videos just to you know my friend came back in town if your friends are stupid enough to do donuts in your cove around four o'clock in the morning just to tell you that he's in town that's a car buddy for you man I didn't, I didn't know that was him because he didn't tell me he was coming in town if you watching this DJ y'all gonna see a video of him but if you watching this DJ yeah thanks everybody's mad at me from that day still <laughs> also I've been working on a, another video with a certain guy and I'm not sure I'm not gonna say his name because I don't want to like jinx it or anything like that but if it works out if it works out it's probably gonna be pretty good so hoping it does praying it does all that because uh, I really want it to work out so I also been working hard on that video but the only way I can get that video out is if I get this car running so what that mean is it's time to get a new motor I need to get it done life or death situation right now life or death It's not really life or death, but I'm just saying it's a life and death. Other than that, guys, I just want to thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you to all my subscribers that have been reaching out to me on Instagram, Facebook, and all that. Talking to me, asking me what's going on, just saying what's up. I mean, if you like to do that, that's fine. I will respond back to you. You uh, you message me on the, I think they have a little YouTube thing now, YouTube chap, ch chap, chap, chapstick. Yeah. <laughs> They have a YouTube chat down uh, somewhere. I don't know where, but it's somewhere. That's it for the video. I just want to really give you a little update of what's going on with everything. I know it wasn't really that much of cars and whatnot, but I mean, come on. It been about a month since I posted my last video. I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, I had to give y'all something. So, I'm gonna see if I can try to hurry up and edit this video before I had to go to work. Uh, yeah. That's it. Yeah. I don't know if y'all guys can do that. Can y'all guys do that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Find out what happens next on D Creators Creations. Stay tuned. And I dropped the camera. And real quick guys, um, I just recently just got a package from uh, Mr. Rose Graphics. If you uh, don't know from the last video, this is his card right here. Um, yeah, basically he helped me out with, he helped me out with getting the decals for the, the Mustang. Uh, he got me the, uh, a little brake caliber decals, whatnot. I put on my brake calibers, though the smaller ones. I just use the bigger ones. He also got me my uh, hood stripe for my hood, and he just recently got me something else. He just sent this out for me, and I want to see what it is real quick. Let's see. Hmm. Huh. All right, so. He got me carbon fiber. I don't know if you can tell if it's carbon fiber. He got me the carbon fiber letters for the Mustang back bumper right here. So, yeah. And I dropped something. But I really do appreciate this. He also gave me an extra GT. And you know, it says it's just a slow sixer. It's not a GT or anything like that. So, uh, hint, hint, wink, wink. <laughs> but yeah, this is nice too. Um, probably gonna put this like on my toolbox or something like that. I don't know what I'm doing with this yet. He's been helping me out a lot for making the car look better than what it does. Uh, I haven't used any of the decals besides the brake calibers because I'm planning on getting the car painted. But 
once I get it painted, these decals are definitely, they definitely going on the car. So, here's this card again, just in case you want some information and whatnot. He do really good work. And for a reasonable price. Oh, and he got his, uh, got his Mustang on the back. He got a 96 Misty. Change colors, green and purple and whatnot. It looks really good. Uh, yeah, let me see if there's Instagram on there. Yeah. Uh, Instagram first Cobra. I don't know if you can see it right in there. Yeah. Follow him on Instagram if you want to see. He also an eBay seller, so yeah. Mr. Dusty Davis. He does really good work. You actually caught me on a really good time because I was I was just about to upload this video. And my brother comes in with the mail, so yeah. You came just in time. <laughs> but yeah, that's it for the video, guys. I'll catch you on the next one.